RPMs are just about 1100 and let's see what the outside temperature is. It's 28 degrees. So I started the truck up and it was at a normal idle for about a minute or so and then the idle increased. got the elevated idle turned on. But as soon as I step on the brake, then the idle goes back to normal. About three minutes have elapsed. I actually got in the truck earlier and when I stepped on the brake, I backed up about 200 feet. Put the truck in park and within a matter of about 20 seconds it went into elevated idle again. So looking over here at my Edge Insight CTS2, engine coolant temp is only at 113 degrees. I don't know what the cutoff is as far as at what coolant temp the engine has to reach before the elevated idle stops. But as soon as I hit the brake again, elevated idle goes off and it drops down to about 750 RPM. Several more minutes have gone by. I drove the truck about 600 feet and put it in park and it went back into high idle. Right now my engine coolant temp is at 129. I believe that the elevated idle isn't just based on engine coolant temp, but also ambient air temp. So probably if uh, the ambient air temp is below a certain point, it's going to go into elevated idle until the coolant reaches a certain temperature. So my coolant temp just hit 140 and the truck went back into normal idle back at about 750 RPM.